Genesis 13, this chapter really isn't about the sheep or the herdsmen. It's about Abraham and Lot, their personalities and relationship. By the end of the chapter, we see the real problem. Abraham loved Lot, and Lot loved Lot a lot. <laughs> and this relational imbalance led to an issue with boundaries. That's really what the herdsmen were dealing with, the lack of managing or respecting established boundaries. Abraham saw this and acted quickly before it could affect their relationship. He knew the best way to solve this was for them to go their separate ways. He even empowered Lot to choose which direction they would each go. And it's Lot's decision-making process where we see a selfish, maybe lazy approach to making life decisions. He chose the easy path, one that would lead him straight to Sodom, one that scripture later says vexed him. There's no mention of praying. There's no mention of him thinking about Abraham's well-being. The text says Lot chose for himself. But there's a better way. We don't have to make the same mistake in our lives. When I have decisions big or small to make, there's a proverb that I follow. It's a simple verse, a simple step-by-step -step process, but I always find God's peace when I follow it. Listen to Proverbs 3. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not in your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him, and He shall direct your paths.